for tuning in to Fighting Saints Weekly, our weekly Dubuque Fighting Saints recap show here on DubuqueFightingSaints.com and the Fighting Saints Facebook page. I'm Zach Fish behind the camera. Eric Prohaska here with you. Zamboni getting out on the ice at the Mystique Community Ice Center. Saints preparing for a big week of practice as they get set to go to take on the Cedar Rapids Rough Riders. Games three and four at the Mystique Community Ice Center this weekend. Looking forward to some great action. Shenanigans going on behind me will all be set and ready to go for the fun of Friday and Saturday. We need the house loud. We need the house proud. Cheering on Dubuque Fighting Saints playoff action. Series tied one game apiece after the excitement in Cedar Rapids. We'll have that in a second, but come on out on Friday. You can score yourself this awesome playoff pom-pom, courtesy of our friends at Dubuque Fire Equipment who are sponsoring the game. First 3,000 fans get one of these. We need them waving all game long to cheer on your Dubuque Fighting Saints. First 3,000 get those for Friday night. Also sponsored by Media Partner for your Dubuque Fighting Saints as well, Extreme 1071. Next game, Saturday, this one will be played, no longer if necessary, 7.05 on Saturday. Sponsored by Exceptional Dentistry, Dr. Ted Murray and Dr. Kristen Burning. Thanks for sponsoring this game to them, as well as our media partner, The River. Excited to see you out there. Hey, if the Saints win Friday, have a chance to wrap it up on Saturday. Let's get to the action from last week. Two games in Cedar Rapids at the Stable. Well, the Saints fans, let me tell you, hats off to you. You made it a home away from home for the Dubuque Fighting Saints. On the road, the Saints took game one. They trailed 1-0 as we take a look at the highlights. Dubuque, though, in the second period would even the game. Shane Cavanaugh, what a play. Makes the move and sets up Phil Bogey. The defenseman jumps in. Tie game, 1-1. The Saints would add another goal in the third period. Just seconds in, Jacob Benson, soccer style, boots it in front. There's Carson Kuhlman. He scores in the Fighting Saints one by a final of 2-1 on Friday. Go to Saturday's game. Things didn't start well for Dubuque. Three power play goals for Cedar Rapids on a major power play. Put them up 5-0 in the second. But Dubuque battled back. We'll see the highlights momentarily around the corner. They would come back all the way in the third and tie the game on a Seamus Malone goal before the Riders won 6-5 as Corey Petrash scored late. A heartbreaker for Dubuque. But when you score five in a row and come back from a five-goal deficit, you have to feel pretty good about yourself and know you're a very good hockey team that can really overcome any odds. It sets up well for the Fighting Saints this weekend. I mentioned those five goals. Of course, we're going to show them to you with the audio highlights as well. It's our call of the week, calls of the week, we should say, for the Saints' epic comeback Saturday in Cedar Rapids. Fans, it's time for the call of the week, presented by Pinnacle Cellular and Satellite and U.S. Cellular. Make sure to stop by their 4th and Locust and Asbury and JFK locations. Right side, Alex Primatera, low along goal line, Malone. Back to Alex Primatera, need a sense of urgency here. Coolman's in front, screening the netminder. Alex Primatera will shoot one, he scores! The Saints are on the board, a 5-on-3. Power play goal for the captain. Tyrone never saw it, and he roots it underneath the bar, his first to the playoffs. 11-0-2 left in the second, 5-1. Peter Rapids, pass intercepted. As we intend for Goss, Alex Frontier on the blue line to Carson Kuhlman. Brings it over the line, leaves it now to Seamus Malone. Kuhlman knocks down. Malone goes to the net, back door. Dara shoots. He scores! Robbie Dara, a power play goal, back to back tallies. Seats are back in at 10.46 left in the second. It's 5 to 2. So it was Dara on the second one. Here come the Saints again. Eiserman with Jared Primatera. He gets it across to Jared in front. He scores! It's a two-goal game. Three in a row. What a play. And Jared Primatera makes it 5-3. to three. Going to work on offense. Up to the near side boards. Carson Coleman gets it back. Towns Primatera. Mines fighter safe. They're only rebound. They score. Jacob Benson. 12 seconds into the third. It's a one-goal game. Helms will keep it in the right point. Benson behind the net for Kuhlman. Curdy steps in the way. Puck comes loose to the near side. Helms steps up. Hit by Tipples. Malone right side. Looks for a wrister. He scores! Tie game! Dubuque has come all the way back. Down 5-0. It's now 5-5. Five to five. Pinnacle Cellular and Satellite. Your U.S. Cellular and Direct TV one-stop shop in the tri-state area. Stop into their 4th and Locust location to save some money. Plus, visit their new location, now open at JFK in Asbury. Pinnacle can create a bundle for your TV, home phone, internet, and cell phones. Like Pinnacle Cellular and Satellite on Facebook to see their ongoing specials. And don't forget to visit their new location at JFK in Asbury. Certainly an unreal comeback for the Dubuque Fighting Saints on Saturday. That was our call this week, calls of the week. 
We need the house packed. Friends and family, bring them out. It's Easter weekend, we know that, but we want you to bring your friends and family out to pack the Mystique Community Ice Center. Cheer the Fighting Saints on as they need your help. Last year, Dubuque went all the way to the Clark Cup. They want to win it again this year. They play better when the stands are packed traditionally here at the Mystique Community Ice Center. So once the Zamboni clears the ice, once the arena is prepared, once we're set to go, we want to see you here. Tickets available, 563-583-6880, DubuqueFightingSaints.com. You can also check out our Facebook page for some great incentives to score Fighting Saints prizes as well. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Looking forward to a great series. Special teams will continue to be key. Staying out of the penalty box will continue uh, to be a big key as well. Goal tinning for Dubuque will be big. We'll see who head coach Matt Shaw starts in goal between the pipes this weekend. Saints win both. Series is over. Cedar Rapids wins both. The series is over. Both teams win a game. Game number five would be next Monday in Cedar Rapids. Safe to say. We hope that this is not our final playoff edition of Fighting Saints Weekly. We're going to go ahead and say it's not going to be our last Fighting Saints Weekly. No doubt about it. I think the Saints are going to have a great chance to move on to the next round. Starts this weekend. Games three and four at the Mystique Community Ice Center. Hope to see you there. 563-583-6880. Group rates start at just 10 people, so make sure you bring your friends and family. For Eric, I'm Zach Dubuque in the playoffs looking to win back-to-back -back Clark Cup. Be here this weekend. This has been Fighting Saints Weekly.